New peer-reviewed research just confirms something that should alarm anyone watching the oceans. The Thwaites and Pine Island glaciers have collapsed before, and they did it repeatedly. Scientists drilled deep ocean sediment cores offshore and used isotope fingerprints to trace where the debris came from. The signal shows at least five major inland retreat events during the Pliocene, a warmer period in Earth's past. The grounding lines pulled back hundreds of kilometers inland, deep into West Antarctica's interior basins. The paper also highlights speed. Model simulations show that once protective ice shelves disappear, retreat accelerates fast. And once the glacier front enters deep basins, the loss becomes self-reinforcing. In the simulations, the main retreat unfolds in less than a thousand years. The sediment record supports this. The team detected debris that could only have been delivered if massive icebergs were calving from deep interior regions. The paper describes these icebergs as potentially over 500 meters thick. And here is why this matters right now. We have already covered the heating building underneath Thwaites, the so-called Doomsday Glacier. We have also covered more than 300 earthquakes in the region that went largely undetected in real time. The past record is clear. This system can switch into rapid collapse, and when it does, the result is meters of sea level rise. That is not a future headline. That is coastal cities, ports, power plants, airports, and trillions in property sitting in the danger zone. It is forced retreat, collapsing insurance markets, and permanent loss of land that cannot be rebuilt.